Assalamu alaikum guys. I hope you all will be fine. Today in this video lecture I am going to discuss about size and depth of footing for two floors residential building. G plus one story. What should be the size and depth of footing with steel reinforcement details. So let's get start guys. As you can see guys this is plan of footing and this is the section of footing. So here this is plan. And this is its section. First of all, size of footing. Remember, guys, size of footing for two floors, G plus one story, it should not be less than three feet by three feet. As you can see, this is the planning. So size of footing should not be less than 3 feet by 3 feet and 0 inches and 3 feet 0 0 inches okay it should not be less than this okay you can increase but it should be minimum 3 by 3 feet so this is the size of footing for g plus one story for residential building not for commercial building the second one is guys that is depth of footing depth of footing so the depth of footing for g plus one story if the size is three by three feet so the depth should be up to three feet and six inches this is depth of footing as you can see guys this is the section and here you can see the depth so the total depth of the footing should be three feet and six inches to the ground level gl okay sorry so here this is g level ground level our nsl natural surface level okay our natural soil level you can say next guys here this is the bed so the bed depth should not be less than 12 inches with concrete cover three inches at the bottom three at the top and three from so for all sides we will use three inch concrete cover okay so depth is 12 inches so after the depth of the bit we can keep the uh, to the height or to the ground level you can keep two feet and six inches or you can say 30 inches so it will be going to the three feet and six inches so now this is the depth of footing for G plus one story. So now let me uh, guide you for steel reinforcement. Okay. So steel reinforcement. Remember guys here, you can use here singly mesh for G plus one story. As you can see in section, you will see the, so these are steel reinforcement okay next you can keep 12 mm die of steel rod with the spacing of 150 mm c slash c center to center or you can say six inches c slash c so this is for main bars also for distribution bars so here remember for normal residential building you can use 60 grade steel rod okay sorry 40 grade so this is normal residential building okay 40 grade steel you can use this one so this is very important which length is 40 feet or 12 meter so guys these are steel reinforcement details for both way for main bars and distribution bars you can use this but these hooks guys you can see at the end okay so the hooks length should be up to six inches or 150 mm so this is very important so you can keep in this 12 inches three inches uh, at the bottom concrete cover three at the top but here guys uh, remember and three inches concrete cover okay so in that you can use one for eight ratio so this this is called nail concrete okay just to provide the surface for steel mesh so hope this short video can help you to know about size and depth of footing for two floors 
residential building so if you want to increase the height are the uh, three story or four, four story so you should hire the structural engineer or just wait for the next video to know about size and depth uh, depth of footing for multi multi-story building thanks for watching see you in next video goodbye